Dustin here, and I'm sure we've all been through a situation where you're at a friend or family member's house and you want to show some pictures or some other kind of media that you have on your phone. So while everybody's gathering and crowding around your phone, you think, man, if I brought my data cable, this would have been a whole lot easier. Well, fear not, my friends. Most houses now have a device that can connect to DLNA media servers, and today we're going to use Twonky Server by Packet Video to do just that. Turn our phones into a DLNA server. Setup is easy. You simply start Twonky Server. The app will start looking for media on your phone. And depending on how much stuff you have on your phone, this may take a little while to scan. Okay, and once it's finished scanning, you're set. Your phone is now a DLNA server. Here in the middle, you can see how many pictures, which is in green, videos in blue, and songs in orange. Hit the rescan button down here to rescan your uh, SD card if you add more stuff to it. And hit the power button to stop the server. In the settings menu, you can change the name of your share. And that's really about it. There's no filter, no way to block content you don't want seen. So if you do have things on your phone that you don't want people to see, be on the lookout for it. Now let's see if everything worked correctly. Here I'm using my PlayStation 3, which supports DLNA. And you'll see here under pictures that Tedus Evo has shown up. Just jump into it and we can view pictures. Here's my IO album. And you'll notice that on some networks there will be a little bit of lag. Uh, Really, you want to use this on a wireless in network if you can. But either way, uh, wireless B, G works fine. There's just going to be a little bit of lag. Let's go ahead and check out some of these pictures. That was actually the first picture taken of me in San Francisco. Food, mustard, all kinds of stuff. And besides pictures, you also may want to go ahead and check out some music. Maybe you're at a party, you want to stream some music. Well, you can do that too with the DLNA server. Hop into music, uh, check out an album. And once again, the bigger fi the file, the more it's going to take for buffer. It may take anywhere from 10 seconds to a minute depending on your network. Again, wireless in is what you really want. Uh, I think this is using wireless B at the moment though, so it's gonna be one of the slower ones. And then, if you are lucky enough to have a wireless in network, you may even wanna go ahead and check out some videos. With the server, you can do that as well. And there you have it, Twonky Server. Twonky Server is a great way to get media off your phone and onto something more viewable, all wirelessly. It's available for free on the market, so go check it out. For more reviews from me and others, check out DroidShark.com. I'm Dustin. Keep showing off those pictures.